to my channel thank you so much for joining me again you guys today we are gonna talk about changing your handling times due to uncertainty you know with everything that's going around today it's just probably best for us to go ahead and make the appropriate changes that we need for our businesses so what I wanted to show you guys, and it's going to be really quick, it's on eBay. So it's a way to change your handling time if you need to increase it due to um, you haven't been able to get product or um, really my, my um, reasons for increasing it is that I'm not really sure what's going to happen in the future. So as far as like getting out about and everything and then actually what the um, delivery services and or eBay, um, what type of processes they will have in place going forward. So, I mean, you don't have to do this, but you know, sometimes if you, you know, just want to take precaution and um, I'm just going to show you how to do it in this video. Okay. So anyway, what we want to go to is we want to go to our, um, the selling page so where all your active listings are you are going to go there so it's under I'll oh, go under my eBay and then go to selling now I'm gonna take you step by step through this and just in case some of you guys are uh, newer so once you get there you're just gonna go to listings and then click on active once you get to your active listings you are going to see all of your active listings there. Then you're going to go over to edit and then you're going to click on however many items you're going to you have in your um in your listings. It'll say edit that many items. You want to click there on that link. Give it a little time. Once you click on that link, it's going to process the amount of items or listings that you have. And then you, if you want to change them all, you can, but you want to select the ones that you want to change. So I'm going to change them all. And if you want to change them all, all you have to do is click this very first box in the shaded gray area. So you will click there and then you're going to go up here to this, um, selection that says um, the category is action you're going to click on the down arrow and then you are going to I'm sorry you're going to go over to edit fields and then you're going to scroll on down till you see handling time you're going to click there once you click there you're going to see this box it's going to say handling time and then right here by this drop down arrow is going to say no change but you want to make a change so you want to select change two, and then it creates another box that says select a handling time. You go over to that drop down arrow and click on it. And then here you can select your, your time that you want to change it to. So if you want to, like, if you've been like trying to figure out how to do this and you want to like decrease your time, you can do that as well. But for this video, I want to increase my time. I did have it one business day, but I think I'm going to need a little extra time. So I'm going to give it two business days. All right. So once you select the time you want, you just come down here to the bottom right and select close, save and close. So give it a time to update and then all your listings will be active with the changed handling time all right so that is all you have to do you guys so um you can refer back to this video you can you know change different items if you like you don't have to do them all at the same time you know if you have access to a lot of stuff that is already um in your store or whatever you can actually change you know the handling time i don't know a lot of you may be doing drop shipping, you can change it to, you know, longer time just to make sure that your items are getting there. Hopefully you're not doing drop shipping, but you know, a lot of people still do it. So, well, that is the video for today. So if you guys have any questions, let me know. 
Let me know how you like this video. If you have been having problems trying to find out where to change this handling time and where the selection was, let me know as well because I have been getting some people asking questions about how to do that. So I wanted to make this short video to show you guys that. All right, and I will see you in the next video. Thank you so much for joining me again and have a wonderful day.